Hello again, we're going to have a game of Why Have the Exploding Fist for the Commodore 64 as we get right underway now. Um, we're the rock, oh god, we get our ass kicked already. We're the white character. Um, yeah, here we go. So, so, reminds me a little bit of IK Plus looking at the characters. Um, but it doesn't play like IK Plus, but all you do is just have one hit of the character and that's it. You get your little yin and yang points. <laughs> As we won for four, all four points, as we go to the next round, it gets harder and harder. Oh, now he's doing his little flips. So, what you basically do, you just get one kick or one punch of him anywhere, and then you get your point. Very simple stuff. Oh, he got me to cunt. Oh, sorry. Oh, I'll watch my language one of these days, I'm gonna get myself in a really big trouble. <laughs> yeah, here we go, got the bastard. <laughs> Ignore it. Um, yeah, it was, ain't a bad game. One of my, one of my favourite fighting games. Um, as we win again, we've got all four yin yangs. As we, oh, we've got a different location. Um, yeah, this one, as I said before, it reminds me of IK Plus. Start the characters. I thought IK Plus was much better than this because IK Plus was one of my favourite fighting games. Get her ass kicked. Um, yeah, especially on the Commodore 64, IK Plus was good, but when it comes to the Amiga, forget it. That was the best. Anyway, it doesn't matter about that. We're not talking about the Commodore Amiga. We're talking about Fist. Why the exploding fist for the Commodore 64? As we well, took the way, I'm getting my ass kicked. Um, and it's game over. So we get to enter our name, yes. Okay, we're not, oh, we must be at, oh, oh, no, oh yeah, we type it, right, okay. Well, it's all coming back to me now. As we end the review here, thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.